I'm Harry, Harry Potter. Hey guys, Tessa here, and for today's video, I'm going to be unboxing something very magical. It's a Harry Potter Cano coating kit. A big shout out to Cano for sponsoring this video. Cano is a company that is known for creating DIY computer coating kits for beginners. The Harry Potter Cano coating kit is a build-it-yourself wireless wand that shows fans of all ages how to code and create through 70 step-by-step -step creative challenges inspired by the wizarding world. Look at how nice this box is. Oh, there's things on the back. Build it yourself, learn to code, wave your coding wand, endless play, and unlock secrets, iconic creatures, costumes, and locations. Look, it's me. Yeah. Oh, this is exciting. Let's open it up. Oh, it's so official and beautiful. <gasps> Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Look at how beautiful this is. I love it. Holy crap, this is gorgeous packaging. There's a strap for your wand. See, I knew it. I knew that you needed a strap for your wand. Thank you. Look at the stickers. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Snake, I'm a snake, I'm a snake. And then a troll in the Guide to wand motions. Oh, it's all the spells. These are all the spells that we can learn. And look, my favorite, Lumos. I love this. This is basically like taking all the spells from the wizarding world and bringing them into your home. Oh, my rolling Canna was making all my Harry Potter dreams come true. Loon, do you want to learn how to code? Okay, first let's make our coding wand that will respond to our movements. Everything we need is in the box. Batteries are here, don't need to go out and make any special trips, which is nice. And here we have our little illustrated instructions. How to make a coding wand. These are simple instructions, they're easy to follow. That way you can learn and understand how you're building your coding wand as you go. Besides the magic, of course. So here are all the different parts of the wand. Okay, let's build the wand. Here's the piece, and here are all the parts. Turn the PCB over, and this is where the batteries go. So instead of having the core of the Phoenix tail feather, it seems that this wand has a core of batteries. Let us add the core of the wand to... <gasps> Ooh! Ah, uh, yeah. So the wand can sense your gravity, speed, and direction. It's just like magic. Leon, you're so cute back there. Leon. <laughs> Grab the button and place it into the hole of the coding wand handle. Button in place. Put the coding wand on a flat surface and carefully place the PCB into the handle. Okay. Grab the coding wand handle cover, slide it in, and clip it down. Aha! Oh my goodness! It's so pretty! Ooh. Look at this beautiful wand! The coding wand chooses the wizard, Mr. Potter. We are done with step one. Our wands are at the ready, and we are ready for step two. Once the wand is assembled, the next step is to download the companion Harry Potter app, which is available on any device, Mac, Windows, iOS, or Android tablet. Then you connect your wand with Bluetooth. Found it. Oh, we're in Diagon Alley. This is so cool. You create a profile and a little wizard avatar, which you can customize with different outfits. Wormtail, I know that's you. Get out of here. Guys, look at my cute little avatar. I love her. Now it's time to explore the wizarding world. There are a ton of step-by-step -step coding challenges. The wand can detect motion, but also can recognize some of the signature spells from Harry Potter. In this challenge, you will use a motion like that of the Accio spell to activate code so that you can add a broom to the canvas. <gasps> We're gonna be using our spells now. Just so you know, the wand does not have a microphone, but I'm still gonna say the spells anyway, because it's fun. Let's open the events tray. Let's drag the block. Open the objects tray, drag the block onto the code space, change owl 
to broomstick. Hold down the button on your coding wand and perform the Akio spell movement. Akio! The broomstick is here! Oh, it worked! Akio! Akio broomstick! They keep piling up. I have all the broomsticks now. Look at all these brooms. Look at all these brooms. I'm a wizard, Harry. Gotta get back to Hogwarts. You gotta get back to school. Guys, it's time to do Wingardium Leviosa. And remember, it's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Okay, in this challenge, you will use the Wingardium Leviosa spell to activate code so you can levitate the feather. Up starts. Let's get the objects. Let's add an object. Let's connect it. And let's change owl to feather because we want to levitate a feather. We don't want to levitate an owl. They can levitate themselves. Let's find a feather. There's a feather. Use an on spell motion. So let's connect this. Oh, we can choose our different spells. Let's choose Wingardium Leviosa. Okay, we're connecting it to the Wingardium Leviosa and change the pin to freeze in every one second. Okay, so let's create every one second. Let's make it milliseconds. Now set the position of the feather using the set position block. Okay, let's get our wand. Let's put the X's and Y's into position. Finally, rotate the feather to match the rotation of the coding wand. So we open the physics and set the angle. Let's open the wand and drag it here. And we're gonna be rolling. Okay, so let's perform the spell. Wingardium Leviosa. <gasps> it's floating! I'm Wingardium leviosa -ing. Yay, we did it! I love this. Professor Flitwick would be so proud. Everyone look, Miss Granger's done it. Once you complete challenges, you earn rewards like costumes and accessories for your avatar. Guys, I'm adding my lion hat. Oh, I love my lion hat. Yay, I am my avatar. Let's go code some more. With this product, you have a block-based interface for beginners, which helps showcase coding concepts and principles. It also has the ability to switch to JavaScript. That way you can see how the wand works through coding and you can develop some real coding skills. There are tutorials and demos and challenges, but you can do so much more. As you advance in your coding, your only limit in this wizarding world is your creativity. Create your own wand art, games, and music. And anytime you create your own project, you can share it through the free online community Cano World. There you can see what other people have created from around the world, leave a comment, or remix someone's creation and make it your own. Okay, I'm gonna go and create my own project. So let's go to play, new creation. When the app starts, repeat, add an object. Let's add, let's add an owl, but instead of an owl, let's make it Birdie Bot's beans. Let's get some beans in there. And then let's add a wand, rumble pattern. On up, the objects did grow. Oh my gosh, they're growing! The beans are growing! Now let's repeat 10 times. Grow in the beans, grow in the beans. Look at these beans getting bigger! And Gorgio! Look at those beans! Got some Felix Felices and some beans. Now let's make them in Gorgio. Gorgio, and Gorgio, and Gorgio. Big up, big up, big up! Just have fun! Guys, this is what this coding kit is all about. Having fun and making it your own. Oh, Ravenclaw! Gryffindor! Hufflepuff! Changing the colors of a potion. Oh, look at all the Pikmin Pops on the train! They're going to Hogwarts! There are all my Pikmin Puffs, I love them! You can change the color of the wand, you can change the color of your fireworks, you can change the second number, and you can choose which way you want your wand to move to control the magic. Look at all the beans! Boom! Oh! The Harry Potter can.
Cano Coating Kit is available for $99.99 at Cano.me and selected retailers. Guys, the Harry Potter Cano Coating Kit is the first ever Harry Potter related STEM product. It allows you to cast spells through the magic of coding. This product is a learning tool and you get to feel like you're actually a wizard. If you are interested in coding and love Harry Potter, this kit is just for you. For more information, check out the link in my description box below. Learn the magic of coding with Harry Potter and Cano. But you know, happiness can be found even in the darkest of times. One only remembers turn on the light. Expecto Patronum!